All right, this was our last practice problem right here. Uh, let's go ahead and do it together. Uh, we're going to use the quadratic formula. x equals negative b uh, plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. This is definitely not in standard form. We've got a lot of work to do here. We're going to subtract 2x. Um, notice that the x squared terms in the middle. So we're just going to put this in order make things a little bit nicer for us here. That's 5x minus 4 equals 3. And then we're going to subtract 3 from both sides and get negative 5x squared. Um, oh, this was a minus 5x. I don't know what happened there. Uh, no, what happened? No, that's a positive 5x. Uh, sorry about that. And so that's plus 5x. And that's going to be minus 7 equals 0. So my a is negative 5. My b is 5, and my c is negative 7. Plugging into my formula, I get negative 5 plus or minus the square root of 5 squared minus 4 times negative 5 times negative 7. So 4 times 5 times 7 is uh, 140. There are three negatives here, though. Um, so that is going to end up being uh, a negative 140. So this is negative 5 plus or minus the square root of 25 minus uh, 140 all over negative 10. And then when we combine those things beneath the root, we get 25 minus 140. That looks like root negative 115 to me over negative 10. And we got to look at that 115, and we got to say, is that 115 divisible by a perfect square? Uh, so we can go through and look at our list of perfect squares. Uh, is 115 divisible by um, 4? Uh, no, it's not. Is 115 divisible by 9? Uh, no, it's not. Is 115 divisible by 25? No, it's not. Uh, is it divisible by 16? Uh, no, it's also not. So we, we, we have to go, we have to exhaust this list um, to see if it, if it, if it works out. Um, as it turns out, 115 is not divisible by a perfect square. So um, the only thing we need to take care of is this, uh, this negative. So the negative comes out as an i, leaving the square root of 115 in there. And then that is under negative uh, 10. And because i is not divisible by 5, the, we don't reduce it any further. And this is our final answer, negative 5 plus or minus i root 15, because the negative comes out as an i. And that's all over negative 10. And that's everything for this video. Thank you very much for watching. If you've got uh, questions, comments, concerns, make sure you, uh, you leave a comment or come and find me, right? Uh, and then we will uh, certainly take care of you. Thank you very much. Have a good day.